We're in the Nike clearance store on International Drive. It's very rare that I come out here, but since I was in the area, I had to pull up and see what's popping. Sorry for the shaky, wobbly camera action. I think about copping this sweater to go with those 200s I purchased in December at the Gainesville Nike outlet. Got some player exclusive joints. Crew neck would go perfect. Unfortunately, I found a better crew neck back when, and I decided to pass. The crew neck I found was a lot more heavier than this. This is a middle weight or maybe a lightweight hoodie. I don't do those. On this purple joint, fitting for $24.99. They do got some heavyweight hitters. This is a heavyweight hoodie in green. However, though, price is also hefty. Coming in at $49.99, no bueno. Usually, these hoodies are roughly around $29. The black and heather gray one was at least the last time I've been here. I don't see none of those, but it's not fair for us to get the green one, the least desirable color, for more money. That's ridiculous. There's a plethora on this rack. Guess what else I found? This is a nice crew neck, by the way. Hitting for $29, and that's more like it. This right here. This is the main attraction. This is a tech fleece in that navy blue, the color I want, that Yankee blue, and it's hitting for 60 beans. It's not the hoodie. I still rock it. At that price, that's not bad. And what about this SB Golden, maybe Wheat, Golden Harvest joint? It says Nike, but it looked like Supreme, but I can't really make that out. I just know it says Day. Y'all let me know what y'all found. It's hitting for $39.99, that's not a bad deal. I'm gonna hold on to this, because I think this might be a purchase. And there's still no shortage of tech fleece. You got this light island green versus mint island green, but look at the bottoms. No bueno, those some wide bottoms. We like our joints, him, but to each his own. Now this is a fit. Look at the pants, look at the hoodie. This is similar to the hoodie I just shown, the Golden Harvest joint, but it got it in this peach color, light peach, and they got the pants to match. I'm not mad at this fit at all. Let's applaud the Nike employee who came up with this fit. That's banging. However, I will have to hem the bottoms. I can't do that. You got some ACG joggers for 60 beans. This is a nice fleece, like the walk. You got the Heather Gray joints, also hitting for 50 beans, or $59.99. You got the maroon joints, not a fan of that. And you got this V-neck hoodie tech pack. Hitting for 50 beans. Retail was 130 though. And you got more tech fleece over here. You even got the darker island green, mint green. Mint chocolate chip, because I got the black pockets or with the taper zipper. I love that look. So all those, you got the maroon joints, hem bottoms, drawstring cord. You're not having that. Have the gray in the building, but these are tearaways. No bueno on those. Oh, I like this watch. It's in for $60. Yo, the price is relaxed. The other clearance, well, this joint's in for 50 beans. I could have sworn this was a $30 jogger. Prices went up. We also got the red jogger tech fleece. Hitting for the same price, 60 beans. Not mad at it. This joint's going for 30 beans, but it's not quite tech fleece. And it's a thinner material. You got some polo shirt then for $24.99 that's not bad I like this SB joint simple and it's hitting for 19 beans would y'all pay that you got some Nike jogger pants above the knee joints and multiple different colors they're all going for $19 including this joint they're cool you could get this Jordan hoodie Heather Gray for $24.99 extra large it's a few of them in the building it's uh middleweight to heavyweight I'll say it's probably leaning more towards heavyweight these joints are hitting for $29.99 I don't think that's a bad price kind of dope to me they also got the tear ray pants in black that's dope and what is this? This is 2XL, in for 50 beans. A lot of material to make this pants. It's thick. Brown fleece jogger, hem bottom. They got all kinds of combinations. Tear away with a kangaroo pocket with a button. Now that's different and unique. How much does this joint cost? Nike put all the function into this pants. Hitting for 40 beans. I'm just upset that these are $50. Very good quality though, man. Heavyweight, damn, sad to see. So this is my section here. And I guarantee I'm gonna find a lot of these joints in the building. These are the Zoom. Fours. These are Team Bank 60 beans. Then you also got the signature colorway, and these are also fours going for the same price. Signature shoe meets Team Bank, both the same price. Are these Air Maxes? These are 90s. They're different. They're oh, they're Air Max 186 OG. 119 is the price. Take a closer look. These are different, y'all. I have never seen these before. You know what? Yes, I have. I saw them in the factory store not too long ago. It wasn't this color though. Only because I like the color. But these are tennis shoes. The Vapor 9.5 Tours, 80 beans for those. Was these an Incredibles? Reacts? Where are they? They're React Infinity Run. Lighting it too. 80 beans, put their sizes in those. That's for those who like running. And for your casual dressers, they got these joints. These are the trainer three low, 60 beans, white, hyper pink. And they got the 2090s, I believe, 70 beans. Not a fan of that colorway, but they got a plethora of them. More colorways, press those in the building, 60. This used to be at one point my favorite store of all of Orlando. The Nike clearance store on International Drive. One of the best stores ever.
I can go on and on about all the stuff I have found in here. Like for example, these are Jordan 37s and these are going for $80. Yes, it's a new Jordan. And yes, it's affordable. It's a number series. This is a great price. Back then, not only you get new Jordans, but you also get retro Jordans, like the fours, the threes, the ones for those price and cheaper. And at one point in time, this store had discounts. It started off as a weekend thing, but later on it became like sporadic throughout the week, whether it's a Monday or a Thursday, you can get 30% off your entire purchase. So it wasn't unheard to find basketball shoes like the PGs, the Kevin, the Rants, LeBrons for this price. That was the norm. However, today we're getting the Zoom Freak 4s for 60 beans, size 12, my size, or you can get the signature colorway for the same price as well. Team Banks used to find a lot of Kobe's in here that was also considered team banks. I'm talking about a plethora of colors. I like this UNC blue. This is a consideration right here. This is fire. I'm considering buying these, man. I love the UNC blue, love the colorway. It's perfect. And to hooping, I remember the Kobe 10 team banks. They have all flavors, guys. I'm talking about just sitting just like what you see here with the Giannis's. Uh, this is a signature shoe. This is a five, 60 beans. So now you can get a five signature shoe. You can get a team bank four, or you can get a signature four, all the same prices. Doesn't matter. What color or model that's very affordable you can't get mad at that what you can't get mad at is jordan putting the okie doke on us these are the air jordan one low they're golf they're here for 109 dollars not only are they golf why are they so expensive see this should be a lot cheaper especially when no one's buying them and you know guys i always constantly preach about doing soul swap this will be a perfect soul swap get the cherry red lows before they're re-release all you got to do is find a comparable shoe to swap the soles out and if anyone that's watching this video can pull that off reach out to me i would love to work with you so we can get some Jordans like these, move the outsole and replace them with some Air Jordan 1 actual soles. So that way we can have a one of one of Air Jordan 1 golf that you can actually wear and walk in casual. Because there's so many models we can do this with. Now we did get a retro similar to this two years ago, the Tokyo Air Jordan 1. I think that's a phenomenal idea if one of you guys can pull that off. Put a little context into the matter. Look at these Air Jordan 4s. Let's say we want to swap the sole. Well, we have to find something comparable. Well, these dub zeros would do it. Why? Because these dub zeros have a Jordan 4 outsole. So that's just one of the few. And if you find an Air Jordan 6 Golf, which they're a lot of, you can use the substitute Jordans, the MVPs, and swap that sold out with the Air Jordan 6 Golfs. I'm just giving you guys the sauce used to swap out some of these shoes. The hardest part is actually doing it. And not only that, you also got to find shoes that's affordable enough that you could buy to actually make it happen. You don't want to pay full price for some of these shoes. These are the Harachis, and they're going for 70 being size 11 and a half. However, Harachis have been running tight recently. You also got the Zion 2s below that. These are going for... 60 beans some jordan 2 lows size 11 and a half for 119 dollars no additional discounts now I'm almost reluctant to actually show this shoe these are the air max corduroy and they got them in size 11 and a half my size i just recently did a video of buying a shoe at one location and returning to another and that video also told you guys uh, that works for factory stores but no longer for clearance stores clearance stores everything is final sale i'm thinking that's true if you buy it from somewhere else and try to bring it back to the clearance i'll confirm here shortly as expected all sales are final that do not do exchange. So I cannot bring my 11 that I purchased at a different factory store to this spot and get this size, size 11 and a half, first size I wanted in this shoe. Anyway, passing that information along with y'all. And look what I found, some dunks. This colorway is loud. These are SE, they're going for $90, size 11 and a half, as y'all see it. 97's in the building, 80 beam. And these are Ear Tune Max, going for 80 as well. Let me know if you have seen this before. The Zoom Freak 4's All-Star. This is a true All-Star shoe. This would have came out 2023, last year, and it's still in the building. No one wanted this. All Air Zoom Freaks are the same price. Oh, I like that hang tag on there. That's dope. And I think I have an idea what that is, especially in the shoe. I'm not sure if you guys can see that. It says Nike Basketball Museum Freak 4s. So I was able to scan it and it do have my size, at least one of my size for basketball shoes, size 12 and a half. So I'm gonna inquire about that shoe and see if we can get it. I think it's worth having. Those are clean to take a look at them. Air Max 1. Nice. This small though. Here you go. How much are they? Oh, $60? Yeah. Okay. And they also got the LeBron joints out here too as well. These are the soldiers. They're going for 60 beans. These are the salt and pepper. They're actually the soldier 14s, if you care to know. I had the blackouts. You already know why I call the blackouts if you're familiar with this channel. You should know. Oh, here they go. These are the Air Jordan 6 Golf Maroons. So all you got to do is get an MVP, swap soles, and your Gucci. And these are going for 180 I got these same slides, SB, and green. I haven't rocked them yet. So DS. I bought mine for super cheap. What they got them for here? 19 beans. Pay a little less for mine, but I'm not mad at it. Oh, got them. Thank you. Appreciate it. And she got them on. You think I found what I need? So I'm out of here. I want to show you guys the shoe. However, it's not my size. Delaney 
one. So you know what's even crazier about this shoe? I mean, the box clearly dismantled. It's not even the original OG box. Look at the price. Look at that. This joint is hitting for $75. It's a size 15 and a half, which would translate to the size 14. That's not a bad price. Now I got me carrier too. They got like a 13 and a half. It shows nothing in the store, unfortunately. This must be the last pair. But yo, for $74, a men's 14, that's not bad, man. Damn, that's dope. These are the times to be an outlet shopper because you're going to find crazy deals. And it's not over, man. The beginning has just started. So it told me this is actually the last size in the building. But for that price, it's worth it. And this must be the first place section. The gold cements, threes, they're going for a buck fifty nine. And you got the gold metallic 97s, and these going for $80. I got one more pickup to show you guys. And um, it wasn't from that store we just left. It was actually from International Drive. Beep the label. Size 11 and a half, one of my sizes, and these are the Soldier 14 Blackouts. If you guys remember a year and a half ago, this was the last year I played basketball in before I was hospitalized when I blacked out after a game of basketball. I want to get back on the court, so this is my motivation. I copped this for $34. Anyways, thanks for watching. See you on the next video. Peace.